Hey everybody and welcome back to another video. I have not done a video like this in a while where I show you guys how I do things. So I'm going to show you through the camera here so you can see what I'm doing. You guys know that I have a Canon PowerShot 190IS and that is this little guy. You can't see the color, it's blue. Okay, so you guys know I have that camera and that for the last recent vlogs that I've done, my videos have been updated from my phone but edited or recorded from the Canon. Okay, so today I'm going to get into how I edit my videos. So currently I use Cute Cut as a form of my editing tool. I do not use iMovies. I, I just prefer Cute Cut a lot better. It's a little bit pricey on the App Store, but it's about $5 and it's, it's worth it, guys. Okay, it really is. Um, to me, I think you get a lot more than you do on iMovies. But to the right of CuteCut, I have the Canon Connect application, which if I just go into it here, I give it access, and then all I have to do is pair on my camera, which I will show you that through the camera right now. So, I have a video that I'm working on and would like to possibly just put a small version up on YouTube. So, let's go like this, and I'm going to push this, okay? Oops. Okay. Let me do it like this. It's hard to move like this. Okay. So I'm going to go to the app store. Or not the app store. I'm going to go to my camera. Connect. Now for this part, I'm going to have to be on my app so you guys will not see the connection. But it says start the Dexit. Like kind of the Dexit designated app on your device so when this pairs like it just did you guys will see that it changed the way it is and that just means it's because my camera is connected so I'm gonna go here to photos and stuff and you guys will get to see the, the stuff I have on here okay so I'm gonna click this one actually sorry I'm gonna click select and I'm gonna select crap I'm gonna select this one and this one because I already have the picture of Goldie, so that's good. Now, this is the part where the video footage is going to um, pretty much download to my phone from the camera, and hopefully it'll go quicker. Um, it's pretty slow. So, and, and this is why I don't like recording big clips, because they take longer to edit. So, um, it's going slow now. I'm going to time lapse this, like speed it up, so that it'll be faster for you guys. And I'll be back whenever it's done.
Okay, everybody. So now I'm back, and the videos are now uploaded to my phone. So that means on my camera here, I can just go and turn it off. All right. So next, let's go into Cute Cut here. And I already have a free phone actually made for this, but what I'm going to do to create the video is I'm going to start a new project and create that small clip video. So let me just create a new project here and I will either change the name later or do something about that. But I'm going to go into photos or videos and I'm going to click the video I want. And then I'm going to have to cut this to a specific point because this video is bigger than normal and I don't want this big of a video. Okay, so here I am just reviewing the video to make sure that the cut clips look good. And I'm also going to have to cut some clips to make it perfect. So I'm just going to go through that process and trim and cut what I need or trim and cut things away. And then after that, it should look good, and I'll play it back to myself again and make sure that it looks fantastic. These things take time to make, but I'm telling you, I love creating videos, and it's been a passion for me. So this is going to be one of those easy YouTube videos. This is going to be a small one for this video that I'm editing here. And... You know, this is just the beginning parts of my process steps of how I like to edit my videos. You guys seen how I do it through my camera. I record it through the camera and then I upload it to my phone. And it's fun and fast and that's what I like about it. So I'm glad I can take you guys on the journey with me as I upload this video. I'm just going over the clips again and watching them to make sure they're perfect. And, you know, every editor, I believe, must take these same steps that I do or similar because, you know, you want to edit your product to make sure that the product looks good. And, oh my goodness, Goldie's face looks so cute in that clip. I just, oh, Goldie's adorable. I just love her. I love her dogs and my cat. Yes, I have a cat. But that's about it so far on the editing process. And let's get to the next steps. Okay, so for this one, it kind of flickers. I hope it got that screen recording. It probably didn't. I'm never gonna be that girl. Up and back in and instead of updating it to YouTube I'm gonna go here and push export and then the high quality because this will export quicker and then it'll go to my photo gallery in my li my um, library so uh, yeah <laughs> I'm gonna come back when this uploads to my library so I'll be back Okay, so I got here in the middle of it, but the video is exporting to my gallery, and it's already done. So actually, this is kind of what I like to do when I'm done with these projects. I go back, and I'm going to delete the video since it's already been done. And the other project you guys seen was the editing video, like the actual product that I'm working that you're seeing this video off of, I guess. So I'm going to click the video here. And I'm going to click the share button and go to YouTube. There. Okay. Now this doesn't show any of my information, which is the good thing about it. So, yeah. Okay. So, first I'm going to go with category. I'm going to put, like, the category I want for it, maybe. Uh... What 
would be a good name? Other than, no. Okay, hang on. I'm gonna turn it to inverse color so I can see this better. Okay, comedy, wait. Okay, comedy, education, entertainment, film, the gaming, how to use music, news, and people and vlogs, pets, and animals. Okay, I'm gonna put those right there. People and vlogs are usually what I do for my vlog videos. So, I'm going to get the title in the description and I'll be right back. Okay, so I've gotten the description and the title up. So all I'm going to do is click the upload button that is right there, or the publish button right there, and it automatically uploads. And this is a small video, so it won't take long for it to upload. But sometimes what I like to do is just go out of the Photos app and let it do its own thing because it will still do it. So I'm going to let that upload, and we'll show you the next part. Okay, so there we go. Now we get the option to view on YouTube, tell a friend, or cancel. So let's view on YouTube and see what it does. <clears throat> it takes us to the website, so that's a biggie that I don't like about it, but that's okay. But you can go on my YouTube channel now and find that video there. So what I'm going to do is delete it from my memory source. And I'm going to delete these other little clips here because... They'll just go into the trash and they'll still be able to be used. But, there we go. So now if we do go on to my YouTube account, I'm going to go over to Uploads, my Uploads, and there you go, it's there. That is my video I just published. And it's called Playing with the Pets. So, that's how I do it. That is exactly how I do it guys that's how I edit and upload my videos I'm gonna actually show you how I get my music so and what I do with that because yeah <laughs> okay so I have this app called Vidator and I've had it for a while I will not delete it because it's no longer on the app store and I don't want to lose it so for this one I think I want to use my death note tracks because I love death note Well, let's go into the gallery now, and the Death Note track will be there. This is about 30 minutes long. So I'm going to show you how I'll edit that into this kind of video. So let me go here. I'm going to go all the way to the very end. And with this, I'm going to start a new track. I'm going to put photo, grab the Death Note video, and then we're going to do audio only. Because this is a cool feature about it that I've come to notice that you can turn a video clip into an audio clip. And for that, I'm just going to turn the volume down and I'm going to listen to it. Okay, so pretty much since everything looks good and the volume is added and just everything, the product of it all was good, we are pretty much finished with it. That is exactly how I like to edit my videos and add music and this video will be uploaded this video will be uploaded to my YouTube so I want to thank you guys for watching this because this is something I felt like I should share with everyone you know and how they should know everything that goes for my videos so thanks for watching this video and I'll see you guys in the next one bye